Hello everyone, welcome to NG Classes YouTube channel for a video lecture series on basic electronics. In this video, we will consider a numerical on diode current equation. In the previous video lecture, we considered the concept of diode current equation and what the equation was. If you haven't watched, I kindly recommend you to watch that video and come back over here. In this uh, numerical, I mean, in this video, what we do is we will consider the numerical. It's been stated that a silicon diode has IS, the reverse saturation current equal to 10 nano ampere, operating at 25 degrees Celsius. Calculate ID for a forward bias of 0.6 volt. That is the statement. So, how do I find the diode current ID? For that, I have the expression ID equal to IS into bracket e to the power VD divided by eta into Vt minus 1. That is the expression. What they have stated, let me write, uh, write down everything. Is, it's been given. So, let me just use a different color. Is, it's been given, which is equal to 10 into 10 to the power minus 9 ampere. That is 10 nano ampere. And it's been given a forward, forward bias of 0 0.6 volt. That means the VD, the applied forward bias voltage VD is equal to 0.6 volt. So, VD is given eta. So, is eta given? They said the eta is not given directly, but it has been said that the diode is silicon. And we know that uh, uh, eta, that is the ideality factor, it is uh, 1 for uh, germanium and 2 for uh, silicon. That we know it, hence eta is equal to 2. Correct? Moving further, uh, what else has been given? Vt. Vt is not given, but we need to find it. We, we know that Vt is equal to uh, k into t, kt divided by q. So, what is this? And uh, t is uh, there in uh, temperature in Kelvin. So, t must be equal to 273 plus uh, whatever the temperature is given in Celsius. That is 25 degree it has been given. Therefore, t is equal to 298 Kelvin. So, substitute all those things. Uh, I can find Vt first. So, K is, we know it is a Boltzmann constant and it, it, the value of that is going to be 1.38. That is 1.38 into 10 to the power uh, minus 23 I will put. And uh, T is uh, 298. The entire thing that gets divided by the charge of the electron that is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19. So, solve this thing and I am going to get the answer for Vt. So, just make use of the calculator. So, we would find Vt is equal to 0 0.0257. Make sure everyone is getting this value. So, once we get Vt, what is the next task? I can uh, substitute everything in this expression and I can solve it further. ID is equal to IS that is uh, uh, 10 into 10 to the power minus 9. 10 into 10 to the power minus 9. This into E to the power VD that is uh, 0 0.6 divided by eta into VT. V eta is uh, 2. And what is Vt? Vt is, uh, we got it as 0 0.0257. So, that gets subtracted by 1. So, that's what it is. So, we are going to get 10 into 10 to the power uh, minus 9. So, exponential of that term. So, e to the power. So, make use of the calculator. 0 0.6 divided by 2 into 0 0.0257. If you do that, we are going to get 11.67 minus 1. So, it is uh, 10 into 10 to the power uh, minus 9. e to the power 11.67 turns out to be 117008 minus 1, which turns out to be. So, uh, subtract 1, which is negligible, and later multiply with 10 into 10 to the power 9. We are going to get this as 1.17 milliamps. The diode current ID is equal to 1.17 milliamps. This is how we are going to get the diode current. But whatever the diode current we are getting, it is uh, too small and it can be approximated to zero as well. 
yes this is how we solve a numerical on uh, diode current equation like this uh, few numericals will be given and any numerical uh, given one must be able to solve this considering the equation and in the videos to come we'll consider a uh, few more numericals uh, on the same concept that is on diode current equation uh, meanwhile subscribe to our channel ng classes for more videos on basic electronics and thank you everyone for watching